What's up everybody? Welcome back to another video with the Roshank Redemption. Today we're going to be playing some more Pokemon Sacred Gold Sinister Challenge. In the last episode, we took on Bugsy and won in a pretty epic battle, all thanks to Shaylay, um, who I'm very happy with right now. Um, Shaylay learned Crab Hammer and ever since it's just been tearing shit up. Um, and in this episode, we are going to be moving on to the game. Progressing through Ilex Forest, I believe, and actually starting off the video here with a rival battle. Here comes our rival. Tell me something. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? You beat them, quit lying. Well, Team Rocket was, like, not too hard. Although that Proton guy was kind of annoying, I will say. Um, I don't know. Team Rocket's never too difficult. Uh, well, actually, that's not necessarily true in this game. I don't know. Team Rocket's more difficult in this game, potentially, actually. Uh, we're gonna Ember. Um, as you guys will definitely see later on. Oh crud, this is a lot. Wow, we're three levels higher and still does that much? That's kind of sad, actually. Uh, we're gonna switch straight on to Leone. Oh man, it is so cold over here. And by cold, I mean like, you know, like 45, 50 degrees. Which is cold for me, because I'm from California, so. Wing attack, that's not gonna do anything. And it's like super windy too, the winds are ridiculous right now, uh, spark. Uh, okay, I mean that's gonna make its attack normal, but like, I don't really care because I'm gonna kill it this turn anyway, so doesn't really matter too much. Okay, that is a dead Murkrow. We just annihilated that thing. Poor Murkrow. <laughs> Alright, Bulls got some nice experience. I'm gonna try and level up Bulls as much as possible because it is pretty close to evolution. Uh, we'll stay in for this. Um, yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna spark. Spark! And that's pretty much a dead, uh, crocodile. Oh, no, never mind. Wow, okay, I totally overestimated Leone. Um, or, yeah. Alright, maybe I just underestimated crocodile, that's probably it. It is only one level lower than us, so. I don't know. Well, it's gonna scary face twice for whatever reason, because it just wants to drop our speed really low. Um, and then it's just gonna die. <laughs> I love it when AI does that. It'll like, like you know, it'll like they'll like use the stat dropping move a ton of times, and they just won't actually attack you. So the stat dropping move was like completely useless in the first place. Anyways, wow, that's a lot of experience. I gotta say, level twenty-three. Roar, we will pass on that. No, I don't want to learn it. Give up. Okay. Ghastly, uh, let's try and take this out with Bulls. Bulls will probably outspeed, because Bulls is... I don't know if it's because Bulls has a good IV for speed, but it's outspeeding everything for whatever reason, so... I mean, I'm not gonna question it. I'm just gonna be happy about it. Oh, wow, we did outspeed. Uh, this should give us a nice special attack EVs. Yes. Alright, that's a dead Ghastly. Poor Gals, he just got annihilated. Um, ooh, Kadabra. I think we could just do the same thing to Kadabra. Although, us outspeeding this will be less likely. Because it is a second stage evolution. We got a lot of nerve coming. What? You're the one that wanted to battle. Oh, crap. Stupid Kadabra. It, it, I don't think it can actually do anything to us, though, so we're just going to Ember. Um, oh, it missed. That's hilarious, because I think Kinesis lowers accuracy, so it missed. That's pretty funny. Oh darn it, this is gonna suck, we're just gonna miss a ton of embers, huh? And this, the, the animation for Kinesis takes like three years, jeez. Okay, well we hit twice in a row, which is nice. And we burned it, okay. So eventually it's gonna die, um, eventually. That's ridiculous. Wow, this guy is so cocky, like the rival battle music is amazing, but other than that, battling this guy is just annoying. Um, Alright, and we're gonna hit both embers, which is nice. Uh, and this thing is dead after the burn. Alright, great job, Bulls. You're a beast, as usual. 589 experience. Play defeat of Rebel Silver. Useless Pokemon. Oh, wow, okay. He's just gonna call his Pokemon useless. That's not why you lost. You lost because you suck. I hate the weak. Pokemon trainers? Oh my gosh. Just shut up. I really don't care at this point. He says that we're weak after battling us and losing to us. That's like actually retarded. Okay. Anyways. Let's use a repel. Repel. Um, okay. Ilex Forest has always been like a pretty interesting place in my opinion. 
Alright, oh man, my boss is gonna be angry. Farfetched took off in the forest. Yes, I can catch you, um, but I always have trouble with this part of the game. Um, <laughs> for whatever reason, catching the Farfetched is just like really hard for me. Which it shouldn't be, because it's like not hard at all, but I'm just like an idiot, so. Oh, crud. Okay, no, we do not want to do that. We want to step on this one, I think. Um, I can always get the first one, no problem, but it's the second one that like screws me over. Yeah, and then we're just gonna go up here and catch it. Um, it really isn't hard, but I'm stupid, so. <laughs> yeah. Wow, you found a far fetched. Yeah, okay. Step on a branch, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, okay, okay. It's not really hard. Um, Alright. Oh, repel's effect wore off. Darn it. We're gonna have to spray another one. Repel. Up. Oh. Jeez, okay. My, my uh, recording setup's kind of weird right now, so pushing buttons is hard. Um, my recording setup always seems to be kind of weird. Ro found a revive! Yay, revive! Okay. Um, up. Oh, okay. I think what we have to do is... Oh, no. Okay, now I remember what we have to do. If you remember what you have to do, it's not that bad. We have to come up here, let it run to the right. Um, oh, my gosh. Alright, spray another repel. We have like 15 of these, thank god. That definitely helps a lot. Um, no, that's not what we want to do. We want to go here and then go back around. Okay, here we go. We actually got it. Which is amazing, because usually I'm like really bad at this crap. Alright. Sweet! Wow, you got both of them. Thank you so much. My boss Pokemon obey me because I'm a badge. How does that work? How does a badge make Pokemon obey you? It doesn't really make much sense to me. Ah, my fire and fetching. You found them for me, kid? Without them, we wouldn't have been able to use trees for charcoal. How can I thank you? Hey, take these. I don't know what kind of accent that was, but we're gonna roll with it. Ooh, HM01 Cut. That's actually a pretty good move in this game. It's power 60 and it's actually a grass type move. And it's 100% accurate. Upgraded to 100% accuracy, so. We're actually gonna teach that to Shele. I think Shele can learn it. Um, I hope Shele can learn it, because I don't think any of my other Pokemon can. Okay, yeah, it can. Alright, and that's gonna be great grass coverage for uh, Shele. And gets like water types and such, because it can't really hit water types right now. We're gonna delete Bubble, because Bubble is a useless piece of crap. One, two, and poof! Shayla forgot to use Bubble and Shayla learned Cut. Um, I guess you guys can't see my bottom screen, so all you guys see is like the top screen. It's probably really boring. Like, oh, what the heck is going on? <laughs> um, I mean, I don't see the point in showing the bottom screen. Uh, I know some like YouTubers do, but I just don't. Like, when I watch a video, that's not something I like to see, so I'm not going to put it in my own videos. Um, unless you guys really like it and really want to see it. Ooh, wait, is this Gardenia? Ivysaur, use Vine Whip! Wait, what? Oh my gosh, I remember this now! Oh, what the heck? <laughs> oh my gosh! I don't know if you guys saw that, but <laughs> look at her reaction! Uh, ooh, <laughs> hi, I don't suppose you saw that! Should've guessed that there would be passing trainers! I'll let you guys interpret that for yourselves, um... But yeah, I remember- th now I remember this from my previous playthrough of the game. Uh, I was never able to look at Gardenia the same after this. <laughs> I can't believe the creator put this in! It's hilarious though, I'm glad he did. Ah, uh, repel's effect wore off. Darn it, uh, yeah, this is the TM case. That's not where I want to be. Repel! Okay. Um, wait, how are my Pokemon doing on health? Uh, Houndor's kind of down on health, but that's fine. Uh, I think there's something here. Yes, okay. Is there something down there too? I might as well check. Nope. Um, I'm too lazy to go that way. Ooh, we encountered another girl in the forest. Hopefully this one isn't quite as weird as Gardenia. Um, apparently she's lost. <laughs> and apparently we remember her from Final Seed, but it's not the same shit. Come on, a girl. We're gonna show her how to get out. I wonder what happens if we say no. Um, it's too late. I already clicked yes, but... <laughs> it's like, how do you know? So you're lost in this forest too? I guess you can't show her the way out. Um, and then my Pokemon shows her. Although, there's really only one way to go, and I think that's to the left, so it's really not hard to get out. Um... Yeah, you can't go up, so... I'm not really sure what was the issue there. Come on, girl. Gosh, girls are so stupid. Oh. Ooh. I don't know why I made that noise. Um, that's not the way. Okay, alright guys, so we're at the end of the forest here, but there's actually some business we need to take care of. Um, I actually want to catch a Pokemon here, so I'm going to cut out until we find it, because it's a kind of rate that's a little bit low. But I will see you guys in a few seconds.
All right, guys, we found it fairly quickly too. Um, I'm surprised actually. It's like a like a, I think it's either four or five percent encounter rate, which isn't very high. So I do not want to kill this thing. So we're just gonna chuck a great ball right off the bat. Um, hopefully this works. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, our next Pokemon's actually gonna be Mistrevis, which um, I guess is somewhat predictable because our choice of ghost types isn't really like that diverse. But Mistrevis is an is an awesome Pokemon nonetheless, and I'm really excited to use it. Um. This mage just is actually one of my favorite Pokemon, um, although that's generally true of like all ghost types. Alright, and I have the perfect nickname for this thing, especially since it's a girl. Um, oh, perfect might be an overstatement, but it's a good nickname, it's a good nickname. And it fits in with our theme. Oh great, confused, right? Um, maybe I should attack it. I think a Kame might, might be best equipped to handle this thing, uh, just because a Kame is Nightshade, so we definitely cannot kill it. Uh, and we're confused right now, so switching out would be like the best play. Alright. What? It predicted us! Oh my gosh! This Mischievous! I can tell this Mischievous is gonna be quite the mischievous one. That was an awful joke, oh my gosh. Someone just shoot me. <laughs> oh good, a comment broke through. If we could break through one more time, that would be very nice. Oh crud, okay. No, never mind. We have to throw a ball right now, because the next one will kill. Um, yeah, I only have Pokeballs left, but I have 10, so I don't think this will be an issue. Hopefully it's not. Uh, worst case, we can maybe switch into... What can we switch into? Oh crap, that's not really working, huh? I don't think anything on our team can, like, really... <sighs> I think anything on our team kills it, honestly. I'm just afraid. Uh, I think Houndour might just kill it with an Ember, because uh, it is six levels higher. Seven now, because I trained it a little bit um, in between while we were searching. Uh, so this is kind of bad. Maybe I shouldn't have deleted uh, deleted Bubble off of uh, Shele. Okay. Alright, one more. Darn it! Okay, this is not working. Okay. Wow, this does this thing only no confuse, right? Let, let me check our options. Who can I send in? Uh Like I think this is our only option, honestly. I don't see any other options. I'm afraid bulls will just kill with an ember. Um Will shoot. Will the water pulse kill this thing? One, two! Oh darn it. We can try a couple more times. I actually don't think a Water Pulse will, to be honest, but we're gonna try a couple more Ultra Balls, uh, just cause I'm kind of afraid. Alright, another Ultra Ball. I mean, Pokeball. Why am I saying Ultra Ball? Darn it! Okay. This thing's catch rate is apparently pretty low. Uh, we might just have to risk it for the Biscuit and go with a Water Pulse. Um, shoot. Wait, let me, let me check, let me compare some, like, stats here. Um, Leone is gonna kill regardless, so we're definitely not doing that. Um, Corfish's special attack is 34, Bulls' special attack is 48, I think a Water Pulse will kill this thing, so we're just going to be safe and we're going to keep chucking some Pokeballs, because we do still have 5 left, so hopefully one of these will work. Um, yeah, 1, darn it, okay, wow, this is turning out to be a bit of a fiasco here. Mr. Vest's special defense is pretty good though, actually. You know what? I think it can take a take a water pulse, so we're gonna try it. Um Yeah, we're gonna try a water pulse. Wait, what does more? Water pulse or ember? I think water pulse from Shele does less, I'm pretty sure. Alright, well that's not really gonna help you too much. Please don't die. Please don't die, Mr. Vess. Oh my gosh, it's gonna confuse us! Great. Ugh, this is so annoying. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die, please don't die, please don't crit either. Okay, well you're just gonna hit yourself. Another water pulse! Astonish. Oh, and now it's gonna try and flinch hacks us. Oh, there we go. Please don't die, please don't die, I'm begging you, please don't die, please don't die, please don't die, please live, live. Yes, okay. <sighs> okay, I'm freaking out right now, guys. <laughs> I really wanna catch this thing and get it over with, because searching for this thing is probably gonna be a pain if I have to do it again. One! Two! Three! Got it! Yes! Okay. That was close, guys. That was close. Gotcha, Mr. Wrist was caught. Jeez, the wind outside is crazy right now. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Um, hopefully not. 
Yes. So the nickname I thought of is actually mine for this thing, uh, which is not like the perfect nickname, but I think it's a good one. Um, I mean, it doesn't necessarily fit, but we need to name something mine. So, and it does have like some pink on it, so I guess it kind of makes sense. Ah, uh, okay, okay. All right, and let's get out of here now. Um, oh come on, with the last step? Are you serious? Great, a Paris, just what I wanted to see. Okay, we're just gonna run. And we're also gonna use the Super Potion on Bulls, because I want to use Bulls in the next fight, um, and level him up as much as we can this video, uh, because something cool happens at level 24. Uh, hint, hint. Alright. Well, let's check out mine stats. Hopefully we didn't get a crap nature. Knowing my luck, we did, though. Careful? Oh, come on! Darn it, I might catch another one off screen and like rename it mine, uh, but we'll see, we'll see. Um, oh, look who it is, people! Hello, Ro, I had a feeling you might pass through here. So you're stalking me, huh? Okay. Cynthia's stalking me, I'm flattered actually, I'm very flattered, but she's gonna give us the odd keystone, which is pretty cool. I'm pretty sure that has something to do with Spirit Tomb, um, which might be worth getting, uh, especially since I'm doing a Ghost Dark playthrough. Uh, I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. The Ghost Strike Pokemon would be awesome because it does have no weaknesses, of course. So, we'll then see you. Okay, yeah. All right, let's battle this old dude. So I do my training. So you literally wait for trainers coming out of Ilex Forest and then you beat them up. You are a terrible old geezer. All right, Electrike. Uh, well, you're just gonna Ember. Ooh, we outsped. Not bad. Oh, sorry, crack something. I don't know if you guys can hear that. I'm always cracking like some sort of bone in my video, whether it's my knuckles or my neck or my arm. Um, right there was my arm. We are gonna switch. Definitely not trying to deal with that. Alright, go Shele! Uh, wow, Shele's gonna annihilate this thing. Poor Cranny does. Uh, as long as we outspeed. If we don't outspeed, then it might annihilate us. Yes! Okay, this thing just got wrecked so hard. Oh, poor Cranny does. Oh my gosh. Up! Oh, okay, I thought it froze there for a second. Crisis averted, people! Crisis averted. Well, I'm really disappointed about that nature. I'm definitely gonna have to catch on the one off screen now. And I will name it mine again. I'll make sure it's a female, too, uh, because if we kind of male mine, that would be very awkward. <laughs> uh, now let's battle this old lady! Let's see how much stronger it got. Probably not much stronger, because Pokemon don't gain EVs in the daycare. Oh! Glitched out. Um, it's permanent, guys. It's gonna be like this for the rest of the game. We're just gonna have to deal with it. Um, no, uh, it it'll fix itself once we get into another trainer battle. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, there we go. I'm the best in my class of Pokemon. I really don't, don't care at all. Oh, classic youngster. Youngster Ian. Bulls. Oh crap, this might not be the best matchup, but we're gonna go with it. I mean, it can't one-shot us, and we can probably two-hit KO it, yeah. Oh wow, okay, it's just gonna seismic toss. Um, it could've been into the super effective fighting move, but it didn't, which is nice. Darn it, I have to go search for another mischievous now. Oh, that's so annoying. Um, darn it. Okay, we got the inner experience. Bon Sly, let's switch. Uh, Leone, you can, oh, 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 never mind, apparently we're doing Leone. <laughs> I was gonna try Akame, but never mind. Akame needs to catch back up with the rest of the team, because everyone else is level 23 and 24. Um, so yeah. We'll train Akame after we, uh, get hounded to level 24. Alright. I mean, it can probably take one, because Bonsai does have good defense. Wow, that's actually pretty impressive. That's not going to be too much. It is a Bonsai. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Night Slash. Electric Dark is like the perfect typing for this thing. I don't know why Game Freak didn't think of that. I mean, it looks like a freaking Dark type, so I mean, it makes it makes sense, right? Uh, we're going to go with Bulls, and we're not going to bite this thing, because it's probably going to Poison Point us if we do. Um, Biting a poisonous Pokemon is probably not the best idea. Alright, Nidorino. Nidorino's cool, I guess. Ember. Poison stick, please don't poison, don't poison, don't poison. Dang it! 
Ah, uh, that's so annoying. That's actually like really stupid. Okay, we're gonna bite now. Hopefully, we get a flinch or a crit or something. Oh, come on. Alright, well, we're poisoned anyway, so at this point, it doesn't really matter if we bite. Um, I think we have an antidote. I hope we do. If we don't, that kind of sucks, because I do want to level up bowls before it faints. We only need, like, one more Pokemon, though. We just need to defeat one more thing. There are better trainers. Okay, yeah, whatever. Alright, then we're back to normal. If you transfer my class, you become the second best student. Or, you would become the second best student. Trade for numbers with me? No, no. Wait, don't tell me- <laughs> Okay. That guy's got a few screws loose. Professor Allen is calling out. Screw you, Professor Allen. Uh, I should probably heal up a little bit. Um, we have- we do have an antidote. Sweet. That's clutch. So clutch. Today I said that, and my sister said she's never heard that word, that expression before. That's clutch. Which just boggles my mind, because that's just, like such a common expression to me. Um, like saying that's clutch. Alright. Grandpa! Alright, Lyra's gonna come down with her Meryl. I'm jealous of Lyra for having a Meryl. Azumarill is so cool. Alright, something about you look fit too. Wait, was Lyra saying that to her grandpa, or was her grandpa saying it to Lyra? Because... So, okay, we're not, we're not gonna go there! <laughs> we're not gonna go there. Um, anyways, follow me, Ro. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna go in here. This is like one of my favorite teams. It's so funny. Grandma, let me introduce you to my friend. This is Ro. Aha, uh -huh, this is your boy friend. <laughs> I see. And Lyra's like, what? Grandma, what are you talking about? Don't deny it, Lyra. Don't deny it. Don't deny it. <laughs> Grandma's like, ha ha ha, I know, I know. Alright, anyways, basically what's gonna go down here is Lyra's gonna give us some- We're gonna get some phone numbers. This is what's gonna go down. I won't spoil it. Um, here, it's my poker number. Ooh, we got Lyra's number. She definitely wants the D. <laughs> uh, you know you can talk to Pokemon as long as they follow you. Yeah, yeah. I love the following feature in this game that Pokemon walk with you. It's so cool. Grandma, don't you dare say anything. <laughs> the return is supposed to exchange numbers, that's all. Okay. Sure, Lyra, sure. Okay. Alright, well, I think we're really close to Goldenrod. Ah, uh, Grandpa, don't bother me. Right, I'll give you our numbers. I really don't want your numbers. Oh, my gosh. Bro, just try the daycare, man. Ugh. Ugh. I hate, I'm so reluctant to give people my number. Um, but unfortunately, that is required. They didn't give me an option. Alright, well, we're gonna go upward here. Uh, and battle this policeman! What's with you? What are you doing? Wow, okay. Clearly this policeman is racist. I don't know why I said that. Growlithe! Oh, crud. Um, it's kinda bad. Yeah, it's getting two minutes, so we can't really do much to it. Uh, I would've preferred if it had a flash fire. But we're gonna try binding it. It's probably be like a three or four hit KO. Three hit KO, that's not bad. Eh, I mean, Leer kind of sucks, but what can it really do to us? Uh, we should have a Houndoom after this, which is awesome. Okay, Flame Wheel. Uh, that's not good, but I don't think it'll kill us or anything. Yeah, okay, because the drop defense did a little more, but I mean... No no danger, really, no danger. Arcanine's a cool Pokemon. Um, I feel like it would have been cooler if it were, like, firefighting or something, but there are enough firefighting types, I guess, so... Anyways, level 24! Are you guys ready for something cool to happen? I mean, there's no point in where you guys already know that a hundred is going to evolve. I don't know why I'm trying to conceal it, but anyway. What? Bulls is evolving! Yes! We are about to get a Houndoom, people, and in case you guys don't know, Houndoom is my second favorite Pokemon of all time, behind Gyarados, of course. Um, and it pains you that we can't use Gyarados in this Let's Play, because I would, but um, anyway. We have a Houndoom, that's good enough for me. Your Bulls evolved into Houndoom. Alright, awesome. Let's check out that, that thing's stats, actually. Because um, I'm sure they're, like, beastly. Ooh, that's awesome. Those are great stats, actually. Um, and we have a bashful nature, so like our attack isn't lowered, so we can like successfully pull off being a mixed attacker, um, which is really cool. Alright, let's proceed up here. I actually did do a little bit of EV training with my Pokemon, which was very tedious, and it's difficult to EV train in-game. Uh, but I actually have fun doing that. I mean, I like perfecting my Pokemon. Maybe it's just, you know, something I like to do, but anyway. Let's level up uh, Ghastly as well, because I think it evolves pretty soon. Um, but apparently, he or she, I couldn't tell. He, he, is confident in his Pokemon's abilities. Buizel, this thing is gonna get railed. By some ominous winds. 
Omnius wins. I don't know if I already told you guys about that, but I used to call Ominous Wind Omnius Wind when I was a kid. I don't know why. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, it did get real. Jeez. Weasel, you're frail as hell. Alright, player defeated Camper Todd. Holy crap, the house is falling down. It's too windy outside. No, we're, we're not exchanging phone numbers. Jeez, what is with these people and phone numbers? Oh, okay, whatever. You're not gonna, you're not gonna, you're not gonna drag me into that. Don't even try. Alright guys, well we're in Goldenrod City, I think that's a perfect place to end it off. Um, as usual, thanks for watching, please feel free to like, comment, rate, and subscribe. The common question of the day is... Ooh, who's your favorite grass type gym leader? Oh my gosh, after that encounter with Gardenia, I can't say Gardenia. Um, probably actually Erica. Erica's cool. Uh, but definitely let me know what you guys think. Alright guys, well anyways, I will see you in the next episode of Pokemon Sacred Gold.